Hey boys and girls, so today, can you tell what we're working on based off of my hat? Do you know what this says? What does that say? Miss T, my name! I'm wearing my name hat that I made. So hopefully you still have your name hat and this is the time to wear it because we're going to be using it. We're gonna be practicing our names in my big basket. I have all the letters and we are going to practice recognizing if these letters are in our name. So when I pull a letter out of this basket, I want you to decide, is this letter in my name? And if it is, you know what I want you to do? I want you to go, whoop, whoop, okay? Can you handle it? And then after that, we're gonna practice writing it with our whiteboard. So you're gonna need your sheet protector with paper in it and your black um, dry erase marker that we sent home. Okay, so let's get started. The first letter is B. If you have a B in your name, say whoop whoop. I don't have a B in my name. What about do you have an S in your name? I do. Miss Thodison. Boop, boop. It's in my name. What about <gasps> a vowel? We're going to learn all about vowels at a later date. What's that letter? An E. Who has an E in their name? Let me hear ya. Whoop, whoop. I have an E. Not in T, but if I write out Thodison, there's there's two E's in there. What about a F? F says, who has an F in their name? Anyone? I don't recall any names with an F. What about an M? Who has an M in their name? Let me hear ya. I can think of at least one friend with an M. I wonder. Ooh, this is one of my favorite letters. A J. Who has a J in their name? I know we have a lot of J's in our class. Let me hear ya. J, 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 J. What about an N? Who has an N in their name? Let me hear ya. All right. Let's do two more letters, okay? What about a K? Who has K? K, 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 K. And the last letter. Dun, 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 dun. L. Who has an L in their name? Let's hear it. Awesome. So now that we've practiced seeing if we have the ability to recognize the letters in our name, we're now going to practice writing our name. So I have my dry erase marker. Make sure it's not a Sharpie or a regular marker because those won't come off this board. I've got my paper and I'm going to practice writing my name. Now when I write, I want to make sure I'm holding my pencil the right way. So remember how earlier this week we talked about how we start we can put our pointer finger and our thumb together, like they're talking. And then the, our next finger, our middle finger, is gonna rest on the pencil. So we have these two and our middle finger like that. So we grab at the end and our middle finger rests. That's for your left hand or your right hand. So that's what it looks like on this side. That's what it looks like on this side. Check yourself. Are you holding it the right way? And then you have your name tags for reference and you also have your hat. I want you to practice writing your name. 
five times. One, two, three, four, five. Five times. And then I want you to show a parent so that I know that you did your best work and all your letters are facing the right way, okay? So for example, M-I-S-S-T. Miss T. Miss T. Miss T. Miss T. Wait, what's my name? Miss T. M I S S T. Notice how I use capital letters for the first letter of my name and the rest of my letters are little or lowercase. That should be how yours is too, okay? Now get to it, get writing. Can't wait for you to show your parents your great handwriting and your ability to spell your name. Bye.